Hello and welcome to Serpent Consulting Services product video series. Today we are going to discuss about CRM mobile application and backend software. So let's have a quick introduction about uh, this CRM application. Uh, why we have designed this uh, software because it is always challenging to track on-field sales executive activities and assign task status. We have designed our CRM uh, application in a way that the back office team can track status of all assigned meeting, current location of executive and completed task march on Google map route. Okay. Now what we did, we have used Odoo's CRM module and did some customization on top of it so when we schedule an activity for specific lead or an opportunity uh, the system will generate one meeting and that will be redirected to the mobile application and the service executive can see the same on their meeting section so here can you see this this is assigned meeting so now let's check this application in detail first uh, this is the basic crm that odoo 12 provides so here we are on a leads so basically you can create a lead from here so let's see how that looks so from here you can create lead and mark that to opportunity so as of now i am not going to create a new one but we will use existing leads so here i have one lead okay so what they need to uh, design software info so what we can do in our application we can schedule a meeting consider that uh, i am a admin so admin or a manager so i will create a meeting schedule so for that i have to click on this schedule activity so i will click on schedule activity and I have to select meeting option okay uh, meeting timing is important part so let's say 5 p.m. today and schedule date will be of two days okay so now from here I can select who is going to attend that meeting okay because this is on field meeting so as an admin I'm not going to do that but I will assign that to one of my executive let's assign that to Anita so next is that i'm supposed to add meeting details some notes and summary so summary let's say first meeting okay and i can add uh, details over here address and country etc so i just modify to india all right now we have interesting feature of checklist okay so if you are assigning your executive for specific task then there may be some list of activities that you want to you want them to perform so from here you can select and you can just uh, click on the first meeting okay so in first meeting we have already added a few checklist here that anti document contract document reports so what happens uh, field executives can add more details when they go for the meeting I will explain you later on when we jump to mobile section so let's schedule it okay so once we do that then in our mobile application once we refresh that will pop up over here so we can see the first meeting is here the place of meeting and start time okay so as an executive i can simply just click on that when the time ups okay now we will see all basic details over here uh, we forgot to add a meeting name if we add a meeting name then it will pop up over here with some notes okay so from here we can start the meeting okay and uh, this will allow us to open this location in a google map 
okay so i am not opening that as of now but uh, let's see how checklist checklist two works so for checklist we have two option either select image from your gallery or you can create uh, take a new picture and upload that so for now let's select from gallery that nda document and so let's take this screenshot okay fine likewise for report i can select one another okay and i can add and with meeting notes so we had a great meeting okay and after that we can end this meeting okay so before ending this meeting let's go back to our backend software and see how this meeting will look like before i have started that so for that we have created this uh, beautiful tab here you can see today's meeting detail and all meeting details okay so let's jump to today's meeting detail and anita olivia is the one who is responsible for this meeting so if we scroll down we can see this first meeting it is not yet green that means it is in process okay the meetings which are over will be in green and uh, you will we will get a meeting note plus we few downloads if they have attached anything then we will get records over here okay now let's go back to our mobile application and end this meeting and mark is as a done okay now if we come over here and just refresh it we will get all those details so here here is a note from anita that we had a great meeting okay the meeting is over so what happens from this status as a manager you can come to know that that anita has completed all of the meetings except to one okay and you can get all details and here is the record we have uploaded two records so we can find that here so we have to simply just click over here and we can download that so we can check what was there in a document okay so now let's cancel it okay and if uh, your executive miss any document then they can simply click from here and they can add from the system as well all right so let's go back to some interesting part of this as this this dashboard belongs to anita we can see location details okay and these meetings are of uh, this specific date only so we can see on location detail uh, this is the current location of anita and this will be the route of the all meeting she did as of now i am doing uh, i am completing all meeting from one location that's why it is uh, displaying like that otherwise what happens one mark will be here another mark will be here and likewise we can see a specific route on which Anita completed her meetings okay so this is quite interesting feature for all companies who want to make sure their executives are meeting all deadlines and they are appearing for all the meetings they have been assigned so for now we have this much of improvements in our CRM application okay now let's see how we can uh, do the same operation from the mobile application itself so we will go to our mobile application and here i am on anita's dashboard so here from here we can create new customers by just clicking on customer we can see existing customers list from here and if we click on this plus button we can create a new customer okay 
so like we can do the same from here as well okay here we can create customer likewise we can create customer from the backend itself okay now we have customers we can also create lead from the mobile application itself okay you have to simply click on this plus button to create a new lead okay and we can add this to system okay so here we have list of all leads that we have created and we can convert all those lead to opportunity itself from here as well so let's click one and we click on this convert to opportunity and it will display you want to create new customer link to existing customer or do not link a customer this is Odoo standard functionality they allow us to create contact accordingly so let's create a new customer for this and by clicking this we will proceed further okay so here we have the client in our opportunity now we can create new quotation on this tab itself okay so let's select one opportunity and create a new quotation so I'll select one opportunity and click on quotation okay here I can add expiration date so I will do that for the next month and mark as well. okay okay once this is done we can define payment terms in that case let's mark it as immediate payment and from here we can add order lines so we can clear create our product or we can select products which are available in our database so we will select our okay and process further okay so we can also see the same here in our uh, backend software that uh, we have created one quotation so let's go back to sales and my quotations so as you can see we have created one quotation here likewise if we create quotation in mobile application that will display over here so back office can proceed further for the sale order activity and everything now mm -hmm. in our mobile application we can also see sale orders from here and we can also click on quotation and confirm the sale so for that we have to just click on here to confirm the sale okay we can see a lot that uh, quotation is confirmed so basically field service executives can perform almost all sales activity from this mobile application they can create lead they can create customer they can convert it to opportunity and then they can also create quotation so it will be very easy and handy features for all field service executives and companies to manage their sales activity and the cherry on top is that you can just see where they are and how they are doing with assigned tasks here we have two options that today's meeting detail okay so we can see by individual uh, employee and here we can see all meeting details so we can see all meetings associated with our company earlier we have discussed about the checklist so let's see how checklist works so here first we have to click on configuration then click on checklist so here are the checklist head so let's create one head that 
provide company brochure and let's give it a name company brochure cb and let's save it okay now let's go back and create a checklist okay so we have first meeting so let's create new checklist just introduction okay and we can select that what parts we need so here we need provide company brochure in that only so we will select that only and we will save that so whenever next time we are going to create a new activity that we will find that option in a checklist so here we have two options now post meeting and introduction if i select introduction only this will pop up over here okay quite easy and interesting to manage a complete crm software if you are interested in such software then feel free to contact us if you need any customization on top of our uh, custom software then we will be happy to assist you further uh, contact us via our website thank you so much for watching this video